Welcome to day four. We have made it to Christ and the cross. Those are our C's for today. We are talking about Jesus from birth, life, death to resurrection. So our first option today is the gospel goodies. I'm sure you can tell this is a brownie with white icing and then red candy on top. Today our colors are white and red. We're talking about the red blood that Jesus spilled and also how it makes us white as snow when we believe in him and trust in him for salvation. So this is a really special snack. I love how it shows even the brownie, the darkness of our sin is covered by that white icing. So if you want to do this snack, there's a number of ways you can do it. You can make an ice brownies for the kids and have them put the candy on themselves. You could do it ahead of time. You could buy pre-made brownies, or you could even have people in your church make brownies, ice them white, and bring them to you. However you want to do it, the kids will love it. Around Valentine's Day is a great time to find lots of red candy. Our other option is the nativity nibbles. As I said, we're talking about Christ from birth to resurrection. So for this snack, we're focusing on his birth. This one's really fun and different because it's almost like they're creating a puzzle with their snack. They're getting lots of different elements and they can use this placement map to see where each element goes. You don't have to use the placement map. You could use whatever you want for your nativity, but this is one option that's easily accessible to you in your guide. So what you're gonna do for this one, you're gonna get four rectangular crackers, like a club cracker, and put those around as if they're the stable. You can take a piece of cheese, cut it into a star shape. We found this star cookie cutter at the Dollar General at the time of writing this. You can also find a pack on Amazon. So you can cut those out, have cheese at the top as the star. We have grapes cut in half as Mary and Joseph. We have a manger with pretzel sticks. One of them is snapped in half, a Chex, in the manger, and then three pieces of popcorn as the sheep. Again, there are many elements to this story, so if you want to add different elements, feel free to do that, but make sure that you make an example for the kids to see, since it would be different than what's on the map. This is such a fun one. It showcases the story that we love. A fun thing that you could do if you would like to is to use Christmas-themed plates, napkins, cups, because this is the Christmas story. And those are your snacks for day four.